Another scooter accident in Atlanta today. A Georgia Tech student has minor injuries after he was hit by a vehicle. Now this comes just 12 hours after the city council held a huge open forum about the future of scooters in Atlanta. Jennifer Bellamy joins us now in J Bell. There are a lot of possible solutions floated last night on how to keep folks safe out there, right? Whether you're riding a scooter, a bike in a car or as a pedestrian walking. Yeah, Ron, a lot of ideas to go around. One pedestrian group wants a 25 mile an hour speed limit on Atlanta city streets, while others want to ban scooters altogether. The city planning commissioner took center stage armed with statistics. Team Keen said there have been 44 traffic deaths so far in 2019. Most car accidents, only three deaths deaths were scooters. He said the problem isn't scooters, though. It's the streets that were designed only for cars. He teased something called quick build lanes, which sounds like a dedicated lane in high traffic areas for scooters or e-bikes. A proposal is expected soon. You know, look at what streets it would be, how, how we would propose to pay for it, implementation, the whole thing. A handful of cities like Boston and New York have dropped speed limits on city streets to 25 miles per hour to reduce the number of accidents, but it seems like it's been mostly limited to residential areas and by schools. Meanwhile, other cities have formed task force, created scooter speed limits and used geofencing to slow down riders in certain areas similar to what Atlanta is already doing.